Hi everyone, I'm going to show you how to start earning more income from your creative business by selling print on demand products. So I'll show you how to um, set that up on your Squarespace website. Um, you can use um, a plan from business upwards. So if you're on a personal plan, you will probably need to upgrade to business uh, or higher. But I would recommend just going uh, up to business first and then seeing how you go in terms of uh, sales. So to start off with, you'll just come into selling tools. It might look a little bit different depending on your version of Squarespace. Um, but you basically you want to get to what's called custom merch. So we'll just click into here and we want to connect to Printful. So that's correct. So we'll just click on connect. And then click on allow. <clears throat> and then if you don't have an account, you'll need to create a Printful account. So you can just use Google or Facebook, Apple or create an account with your email, but I've already have an account. So we'll click on continue. And connect. Um, and then from there, uh, it's created a store in this Printful account. And then we can go ahead and add products. <clears throat> So of course, there's a whole um, uh, lesson in, in terms of what products you should add depending on your uh, target market. But I'll just show you um, just how to add uh, any product just for starters. And in your settings, you will need to um, uh, put like where your shop is located and also what um, currency you take and things like that. <clears throat> I've already inputted that. So let's just have a look at some products that we have. So we have, let's say, a wooden ornament. Um, or a glass, stem glass, okay. And you'll come to the design maker, we'll click on continue, start designing. And here you can upload your designs. So here you will need your high resolution um, images of your artwork or designs or photography if you're a photographer. Um, so then you will click on upload. And we'll just go to upload new file. Um, and I'll just put anything here for now, just as a test. Um, I'll just put a random design. Um, just a logo will do. And then it will upload that file into your file library. So you'll be able to reuse that for other products as well. So we'll just click on apply. And you can kind of see that they're kind of prompting a more horizontal shape for this particular design. But uh, we'll just do this just for our um, 
just to show you how it works. So that is all good. Um, and I'll just move this across and then click on continue. <clears throat> we'll just go with uh, basic mockups. There. Okay, and we'll just, you can also optimize where it is placed. And continue. And this is how it will actually upload onto your Squarespace website. So it is a little bit confusing because you're not within Squarespace, but you're creating these products. But what it will do is create an automated feed and go straight into your Squarespace website. So people won't even know that they are um, shopping for things on Printful. Um, uh, all they'll know is that they're buying something in your shop um, that is a, like a print on demand product. So here is where you will add more details that is unique to your product. So for example, say this is a Hidden Lanes branded stainless wine glass. Um, and then you can completely change this or you can leave some things that people would want to know. Um, a good idea here is also to give a little note to say that these products are um, created on demand um, just for uh, reducing waste and things like that so it does take a little bit more time to create and get to you um, just to let people know that it could take um, a little longer than just a few days um, and then you'll also uh, select where the product is so it will just be in the store um, and <clears throat> Um, oh, here we go. They have actually created this benefits and then we'll click on continue. Now we will set the retail price. Um, so we will create the price. So all variants. Uh, there's only one variant so we'll just create this to be uh, 25 dollars so the estimated it'll give you the estimated revenue which is um, 11 dollars 88 so that's how much that you would make after the um the fees from printful so we might say um okay so maybe we'll actually make it 30 dollars um, and then we'll click on submit to store. And now what it's doing is it's actually syncing to your website's store. So 